He is relentless in campaigning on behalf of his daughter, who will remain in jail until midsummer. As I had said in the court, and this court is illegal. For that, the court for us as a Palestinian is not just for the, it, not for justice. It's part of the component of the occupation or the occupier system. It's for to punish the Palestinian. 99.99 percent of the uh, prisoners are guilty. Ada Tamimi became famous after a video showing her slapping and kicking an Israeli soldier went viral around the world. She became a hero among Palestinians, but was vilified in Israel. Here was a teenage girl who had publicly humiliated the army and deserved the harshest of punishments. And even when handcuffed and shackled, she continued to show strength of character, saying defiantly in court, there is no justice under occupation. After entering a plea bargain, Ahda Tamimi was sentenced to eight months in prison and fined about $1,500. There are about 300 minors currently held in Israeli jail and who, like Ahda Tamimi, had to appear in front of a military court. Most had to also enter a plea bargain to reduce their sentence or else face long-term detention. Her case is exceptional because it has attracted international attention, but it's no different from other cases. There's no trial. Because, because this process happens the way it is, what tips the, the balance is the decision on remand. This is what ends the deal. Once that happens, the next step would typically be the plea bargain. Once the plea bargain is there, it means that the role of the court is minimized to actually just approving the plea bargain. And that's what happens almost all of the time. The human rights organization B'Tselem says the conviction rate for Palestinians in Israeli military courts is almost 100%. Basim Tamimi is worried about his daughter and her mother in jail, even there is a certain pride about the impact her case has. It's broke the stereotype about what the Palestinian is, because they show a Palestinian as an armed and a man holding a weapon, or making a suicide bombing, or have a knife, but they see a young, blonde, blue-eyed girl, with her, with her hand slapped, the, 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 the central image of the power of the occupation, which is the army. Ahda Tamimi also received a three-year suspended sentence. But if the aim of her detention is to intimidate young Palestinians, it seems that she has only inspired many more to stand up against the occupation. Mirab Al-Jazeera in the occupied West Bank.